Am I the asshole for filing for divorce and disowning half my family? I 34F and my husband 36M have been married for 6 years, to preference this, this happened during the winter months, it'll make sense later, I have been out of work for 4 months due to layoffs and no one seems to be hiring, after applying to no less than 400 jobs I finally get a job offer, it started 8.30am sharp for my first day. My husband reminded me before bed that I should check that my alarms are correct, I checked, they were fine and we went to bed, I wake up the next morning and my husband has already gone to work and I realize it is 9am. Mortified I called my new employer and explained that I would be there as soon as possible, I checked my clock and the alarms were set, for tomorrow morning, I get to work and apologize profusely and let them know it will not happen again, I told my husband what happened and he was angry with me. My new employers were gracious in giving me a second chance so I was adamant I would not be late. Next day rolls around and all is fine, I wake up on time and work went really well, we had date reservations set for 7.30 and I was very excited, while I got ready I get a call from my husband, he's asking where I am and if I found proper parking, I told him it's only 6.30 something, I am still at home getting ready, he was super hurt, asking if I forgot date night, confused I say no I'm getting ready right now. He then tells me it is 7.39, I compared the clock in our kitchen with my phone and it was an hour off. I apologize and start rushing out the door, he accepted my apology but I could tell he was very hurt and disappointed, the date was quiet, he hardly said a word the whole meal, when we got home I went to show him the kitchen clock, it now matched the time on my phone, it had jumped an hour at least. My husband was fuming and told me if I forgot or was accidentally late to just own up to it, not to lie to him like a child, I tried to explain but he shut me out totally and didn't speak to me for the rest of the night. The next day my alarm goes off at 6.30 am, husband's gone to work and I get ready. Once I get into my car I see the clock on my dash reading 8.30 a.m., I check my phone and it also reads 8.30 a.m., I'm tearing up at this point, how did I lose a whole hour? I call my employer but no one picked up, when I get to work and read the clock, it showed 5 a.m. exactly, they are still closed, at this point I feel like I'm having a mental breakdown and drive back home, my husband's car is in the driveway, I sit in my car and stare at his plates rereading them over and over to make sure it was the same car. He was not in bed this morning, his car was not in the driveway when I left, he gets up at 5.30 a.m. and leaves by 6.15 a.m. at the latest, I storm into the house, he was sleeping soundly in bed and I woke him up crying, blubbering I told him about my car clock and my alarm clock, he looks at it shows accurate time as his phone. I drag him out of bed and show him the car clock and it now matches his phone, my alarm clock, and my phone, I started bawling, my husband is freaking out about my behavior and asked if he needed to take me for professional help. Nothing made sense to me and I told him I needed to go to my parents to work through my shit, he insisted that he drove me. The entire way there he held my hand and said we would work through this together and when I'm more stable we can get into therapy, he dropped me off and I looked at the car clock and my parents clock in the living room, they matched, I spilled to my parents about what's been happening, I feel psychotic, and my mom suggested I put cameras facing my car and change out my alarm clock. This way I could look back and see my missing time, this gave me a lot of relief.